Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. This is episode 46, I believe. And uh, I just got to the bus. I'm extremely cold. So I got my I got my heater going. Hopefully that warms me up pretty soon. So today we are working on our wood burning stove, which is gonna be great for us because that stove is gonna heat up the entire bus. Um, it's gonna be great for when we're in the snow. So I am going to make a, obviously I have to put the stove together and I'm also gonna make it a little platform that it can uh, be elevated on just a little bit. We don't want it sitting directly on the ground and for the walls around the wood burning stove, we're gonna put cement boards. We don't have the cement boards right now. Um, and we're not gonna drill the hole in the ceiling for the smoke to go out just yet either um, because we don't want anything coming in right now. So I'm gonna put it together. I'm gonna put the platform together and I'll have to go get some cement boards and then we'll cut the hole probably, I don't know, whenever Kaylee comes, she's working right now. But uh, this is exciting because this will be great to have some extra heat for the rest of the build because it is getting very, very cold. And then we have an update on the plumbing situation. So for the past three, four days, I've been working on the plumbing situation and it is extremely, it's not difficult, but it's like I come back and I get ready to, to work on it and then I'm missing something or this is the wrong size or I gotta take this back or I gotta get something else. So I actually found a, a YouTube video um, as far as the kitchen sink that we found an even simpler way to do it and i'm super excited about that i don't want to tell you but just know our whole plumbing situation from the tank the shower and the faucet is going to be switched up uh, it's going to be an even easier way and i wish we would have found out this way before but probably have to take a lot of that stuff back because we won't be needing it so y'all stick around stay tuned make sure you like this video leave a positive comment and don't forget to subscribe all right y'all so here is our wood burning stove it's not big at all it's perfect size to fit in this corner right here uh kaylee even went and got some wood from her uh family yesterday so this is just pretty cool to even see in here um I'm gonna start by making the platform first and then we'll put this together. So let's get right into that. Okay, so everything is gonna be set up in this corner right here. But what we're gonna do is, uh, we'll come out right here. I'm gonna try to angle this a little bit. Um. So I'm gonna have to cut a few pieces. Let's try it. All right, so I just cut out all the pieces of wood that I need. I'm thinking two over here and two over here should be enough for a base and things not too heavy. Um, I might actually cut one more for this middle part just cause it's throwing me off. And then I'll start drilling stuff together and then I'll put that together. so i got all of the little support beams uh screwed in let me put this back in here one more time and make sure everything fits before i nail these into the ground all right everything is nailed in everything is real sturdy so now we have to build a platform for it to sit on top of it Actually, before we move on, what I was just thinking about is that I didn't have any support beams in the back. Wasn't sure how sturdy that would have been, but I stopped that and I actually cut out two more pieces. Now I'm cutting out the 10 inch uh, beams and then we'll put the top on it. All 
All right, so I just cut out the side boards. Uh, the good part about it is I only needed two, and then we're gonna put the one on the top. But I'm gonna put, I'm gonna nail these two in first. They meet uh, nice and evenly down here, so that's good. And let's screw these in. So I just cut out some pieces for the top. We have some leftover pieces uh, in the back because we redid the front part of the couch. So these came in handy. But I think I got the right measurements. I got to screw these in. Okay, so we got our box. We got our base. And mind you, we're gonna have cement uh, wall, cement wall right here, a cement wall back here, as well as on this side of the wall. The bottom part, I'm sure, will be painted. That will be covered up. So for the most part, it looks great. Now let me try to put this together and see how it all looks. So I finally finished. Um, I still got three more pipes to put on, but that's going to go out of the roof. So let's put it on top of here and let's see how it looks. Oh, look at that. Look at that, man. That don't look half bad, right? So this wood burning stove is going to heat up the whole bus. This is also a hot plate right here. We can cook on top of here, put a skillet or put it directly on top. Um, here's a little door where our wood goes in. This is the ashtray. Ashtray, and then you can close it, lock it right there. Uh, we got little trays on the side that fold in. You can put a plate or two on there. Um, and then obviously we'll run a hole through the ceiling and through the roof so the smoke can go out but overall i think this is a perfect height for it and again we're going to have cement blocks which stops um like prevents fire and waterproof and stuff so we're going to put it along that wall this wall and underneath here but y'all leave me a comment let me know what y'all think we finally got it finally got it done Thank y'all for tuning in to this video. Make sure you like this video. Leave a positive comment, please. And don't forget to subscribe.